Hello YouTube! Welcome to my channel! So, today we are going to be shooting one of the most expensive Nerf guns you can get on the market today. No, it is not a Crimson Strike long shot. With a front gun. No, it is not a real Enfield rifle. Nope. Not a big bad bow in mid condition or a crossbow. Nor an original Laramie AS20 new in box. Nope. It goes for about around $450 used and thousand dollars for an F attachment. Big hint there. Yep, we are shooting a trombone today. <laughs> Now, trombones are a part of the brass family of instruments. They sound wonderful, especially if you have a nice lacquer bell. I do not. Now, I'm not going to be playing this today. However, I am going to be shooting it. So, you may be wondering, how do you shoot a Nerf Dart out of a trombone? Well, there's actually two different ways. You could load a, you know, Mega Dart into the gaming slide. Or, if you want to do it the easiest way and the most convenient way, just straight up take the bell off, drop it down, and well you know, there's a perfect size hole for your elite darts. So, what do you do then, you say? Well, you grab yourself a little elite dart here, right here. Jam it in one end, just a little bit. <laughs> then after it's all the way down there, you take off your slide lock, pull out the slide, Hold down the mouthpiece hole and you get about elite ranges. <laughs> and then when you decide to shotgun load it, which is where you load seven rounds into the slide at once, it's just completely crazy. It's just complete explosion. Now you may be saying, but why would they use a slide then? I mean the bell, whatever. Why would you use this then? And you could just point out, you know, Put an attachment on this and then just shoot Mega Darts out of this. Well, the problem is that costs a lot more money. Because that would mean that you'd have to find an adapter that has the diameter of a tuning slide. And then you'd have to get some random PVC and then all that other putty and then epoxy and that jazz. Then you would... Why would you do that when you can just simply attach the bell of a trombone onto the slide of a trombone like you're supposed to. And then cram a Mega Dart into the tuning slide. So, how would you do that, you say? Well, you grab yourself a Mega Dart, you yank out your tuning slide, you jam your Mega Dart into that tuning slide, twist it in, plug it back in, and then you're done. Now that's only loading. Then to fire it, of course you do the same thing. I'm just firing it like this so it can stay in camera view. And then you just you know, cover it with a mouthpiece hole. You can hear him whistle. That's a good sign. Or is it? No, come to find out, whistling mega darts mean it's, it's traveling under the speed of an elite dart. What that means is that if it's traveling under the speed of an elite dart, that means it's traveling slow enough for air to be able to go around this airfoil to cause it to whistle through all this whistling hole. But that is unimportant. Now, unfortunately, no, you cannot use magazines with this. No. I tried jamming a magazine on here, it just doesn't fit. I tried it on here, I tried it on here, I tried it on here. Nope, don't worry. I tried pulling the slide all the way off, putting it onto the slide, and then, you know, trying to do something with that. Nope, don't work. So, yeah. This is wonderful. Wonderful. I may 